finally has her first smartphone, and she is excited to chat with her friends. She already knows that there are many different messenger solutions, some much better than others, but she also knows that if she chooses a different one to the one her friends have, she will not be able to communicate with them. Finally, Jane decides to download the same one that her friends are already using. She prefers to be compatible rather than to use a better solution. To fit in with her friends, Jane is forced to be compatible, discarding all other solutions. This effect is known as a market lock-in, based on positive network externalities. Market lock-in with network externalities is very inflexible and many companies already operate under these phenomena with direct business benefits. They irreversibly take all the market share, which maximizes their revenue while minimizing their business risk. The barriers against all other competitors become higher with a positive feedback effect, as all new users like Jane will have more of an incentive to consume the same solution to be compatible, so it becomes the de facto standard. Network externalities are natural in peer-to-peer -peer communication environments like fax, email, messaging, or video games. But it is a revolutionary and very attractive strategic approach that we can implement in your organization by adding innovative solutions to your products or services based on network externalities to lock in your market and improve your business results. For example, reduce your customer acquisition cost. Increase your market share. Increase your average revenue per customer. Minimize your churn rate. Avoid price war strategies. Or accelerate technology adoption. Since 1999, we have been working with global companies, mainly in Mexico, Spain, and the USA, as well as with federal governments, helping them to develop operational and market efficient solutions. Lock in your markets, innovate and implement two original solutions based on positive network externalities to improve your organization's results.